Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Lady Raven. Hurry, come on, come on. Wait, 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 wait. I got time my shoe. No dad jokes, this is serious. Come on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I mean, Lady Raven. Lady Raven. Lady Raven. Ah, makes sense. Slap dad. Thank you. Thank you. This is literally the best day of my life. Josh Hahn is giving me some creepy right. vibes. Right. Cooper, Jamie, what's with all the police trucks outside? The camera's everywhere, Jamie. I'm not supposed to tell. Something happening? Don't ram me out. I won't. You know the butcher? The freaking nut job that goes around just chopping people up? Well, the feds or whatever heard that he's gonna be here today. So they set up a trap for him. This whole concert, it's a trap. They're watching all the exits, checking everyone that leaves. There's no way to get out of here. I'm sorry, Riley, what was that? I like this new new way of doing his films. A realistic experience as opposed to supernatural. Your daughter's never gonna forget this day. You're kind of dope, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'll say this, I like the premise, the point of which the main character is the antagonist and will follow the antagonist journey through the film. Now not to say that this is not the first film ever to do this, but the fact that M. Night Shyamalan, I respect the fact that he's moving away from supernatural films and going with something more grounded and that is essentially a slasher. So once again, in terms of the synopsis, in terms of the story of this film, it's a psychological thriller that's set against the backdrop of a concert. And in this film, you've got Josh Harnett who plays a father and he's got his teenage daughter attending a pop concert and he discovers that the event is basically a trap. And I like the fact that it's the antagonist we're following. However, I would have preferred if we would have seen this twist when you watch the film and not the trailers and the fact that using a concert as a psychological backdrop it's not often you see that but you gotta admit though in a world where we're getting so many prequels sequels and remakes M. Night always comes out with something fresh and he tries to push out something new but at the same time people do have the tendencies to rip apart his films but I'm gonna be honest I like his movies and I cannot wait for his daughter's directorial debut in future film for The Watchers, which is coming out very soon as well. And I don't know if it's just me, but this kind of reminds me of Taylor Swift. The idea of having Lady Raven having the same publicity and the same following as Taylor Swift. It seems like M. Night Shyamalan did not like the Eras tour. What do you think of the official trailer for Trap? Are you looking forward to it or are you making sure your expectations are lowered?